Humicite, a clinical stage regenerative medicine company, recently received exciting news. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration, FDA, has granted approval for their novel acute vascular graft, SIMDIS. This is cellular tissue engineered vessel is poised to redefine the treatment of vascular trauma, offering improved patient outcomes compared to existing therapies. In this video, we lines discuss why this FDA approval is a significant milestone for Humicite and, and how it positions the company for success in the dynamic field of vascular grafts. Simvis showcases Humicite's proprietary vessel XG technology, which has demonstrated superior patency rates reduced infection rates and enhanced biocompatibility compared to traditional vascular grafts. As a result, this innovative product holds immense promise for improving the lives of countless patients in need of vascular interventions. The vascular grafts market is on an upward trajectory and is projected to reach to point $8 billion by 2030, growing at a compound annual growth rate CAGR of 7.2%. This growth can be attributed to several factors, including the increasing prevalence of cardiovascular diseases, advancements in medical technology, and the rising demand for minimally invasive surgical procedures. Humicite S differentiation strategy has been focused on developing a bioengineered vascular graft that addresses the limitations of existing synthetic materials while leveraging the power of human cells and extracellular matrix. By utilizing a decellularized human vascular matrix and repopulating it with the patient's own cells, Simvis offers a truly unique solution. In preclinical studies, Simvis has demonstrated remarkable results, with patency rates exceeding 95% at one year, significantly outperforming the 70 to 80% achieved by synthetic grafts. Additionally, Simvis's infection rate is approximately 1% far lower than the 5 to 10% associated with synthetic grafts. These superior outcomes are driven by the fact that Simvets integrates with the patient's blood vessel wall, promoting seamless integration and reducing the risk of blood clots. The merger between Humicite and Alpha Healthcare Acquisition Corp. AHAC proved to be a pivotal moment for the company. It not only provided Humicite with the capital to advance its pipeline of cell-based therapies, but also positioned it strategically within the broader healthcare industry. As a result of the merger, Humicite went public on the NASDAQ Global Select Market under the ticker symbol Huma, raising significant capital to fuel its product development, commercialization, and expansion efforts. Furthermore, the merger significantly strengthened Humicite's market position, reinforcing its credibility within the biotech sector and attracting strong investor confidence and strategic partnerships. With the financial backing and market presence secured, Humicite has been strategically advancing its pipeline of cell-based therapies, including the development of Symbias. The recent FDA approval for Symbias marks a significant milestone, reflecting the culmination of years of research, development, and clinical trials. Looking ahead, here are the most likely disease indications and clinical applications where this graft could be transformative. 1. Peripheral artery disease reduced blood flow to the limbs. 2. Hemodialysis access, AV fistulas and grafts for patients with kidney failure. 3. Coronary artery bypass grafting, see ABG for patients with severe coronary artery disease. In conclusion, Humicite's recent FDA approval for Simbis represents a significant leap forward in the field of vascular grafts. This innovative product has the potential to revolutionize the treatment of vascular trauma and improve the lives of countless patients. As Humicite continues to advance its pipeline of cell-based therapies and expands its market presence, the company is well positioned to make a lasting impact in the healthcare industry. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel.